Hey, how's it going everyone? Brad Smith here with HealthLink, looking for the most trusted business owners throughout the world. And I'm pleased to be joined today with Reed, owner of Functional Diagnostic Nutrition. How are you today, Reed? Fantastic, Brad. Thanks for having me here. Hey, thank you so much for jumping on. I'm excited to hear about your business. You're helping a ton of people and it's taken it, you know, nutrition and health to a whole different level. So if you could tell the audience um, a quick summary of what you offer and what you do. Yeah, that's exactly right, Brad, and thanks. Uh, we take personal trainers, nutritionists, and health coaches to another level because we teach them to use functional laboratory work in their practices so they can find out what's really wrong and fix it. Instead of just treating the symptoms, you know, we want to find out what the underlying causes of a person's health problems are and fix it at that level. So that's what I do. I've been training people for 10 years to do that. That's awesome. That's incredible. I get this question a lot. A lot of people are interested in this, actually. Uh, trainer, not only trainers, but nutritionists, because I feel like they want to take their clients to that next level, but they're, they're not really sure how. So when the, the labs and saliva tests and everything comes in, it sparks their interest. Is that what you're seeing on your end? Yeah, exactly. Uh, I started back in 1999, you know, around the turn of the century, and I was a personal trainer and a nutritionist. Back then, we didn't have health coaches. We were health coaches. We just didn't call ourselves that, you know. So I was a personal trainer and nutritionist, and I was still struggling with a lot of people because diet and exercise, it would move them forward, but it wouldn't really resolve some of their chronic long-term conditions. So I started studying the lab work, and I used that for 10 years. I used a lot of my own uh, you know, observations and things to create a protocol. And so now we have training available in the uh, investigation, which is using the saliva testing, urine testing, blood testing, stool testing. You know, Again, it's learning what to fix, knowing f for sure what needs fixing, and then the protocols to fix it, but those go beyond the diet and exercise. We include, you know, rest and a lot of stress reduction. You've probably heard that word stress before. And then of course, supplements, you know, so diet, rest, exercise, stress reduction, supplements. And so it's a complete system of protocols and a complete system of investigation. And so we actually do take the personal trainer, nutritionist and health coach way up to the next level. Now, what made you transition from, you know, just helping people uh, with their health to taking it to the next level and now helping coaches and trainers, which is actually helping you reach more people because you're reaching more people through them. Why did you decide to help them out, build their business? You just answered the question yourself. You know, it's because my mission originally was to help as many people as possible. And so after 10 years of working in a clinic, I helped thousands of people. I did very well. And yet I wasn't really getting out there beyond, you know, Southern California. I'm in San Diego and I could only work so many people myself. So I taught my first class. There was only 20 people in it. And I taught 20 people how to duplicate my system. And it just caught on. And, and now that's what I do full time. It's, it's, quite, a, it's quite a course. It's quite an education, and uh, now we've been doing that for 10 years. It'll be 10 years next Next summer will be our uh, anniversary. Well, congratulations. That's awesome that you're doing that. Thank you for helping so many people out. Um, tell, take me real quick through the course. So obviously you're going to have them you know, do the blood and the saliva tests and all the samples, but do you actually tell them what to do once they get those results back? Exactly. The course is actually in three major segments. There's, you know, 15 to 20 modules. Uh, we're always expanding and growing it. But first you learn how to do the investigation. So I teach you how to look at hormones, the immune system, digestion, detoxification, energy production, and the nervous system. So you need to be able to really investigate, find out what the healing opportunities are. Now that's the key word, healing opportunities. What are they? What needs fixing? Now then there's a whole system of protocols. So a very specialized ways of finding out the exact right diet. And of course I teach 
you know, all about food. It's really a course in nutrition in a sense, the diet part. And then rest. I've studied rest. I'm an expert in sleep. It's one of the, my favorite things to do, actually. And then, of course, exercise. You know, we're all personal trainers and that, so uh, we have to cover that. Stress reduction is probably the biggest area of the protocol to learn because we find the hidden stressors. People have food sensitivities. They have parasites, bacteria, fungus, virus. And then there's all this other stuff in our environment that could be very stressful that's actually quite hidden to the person. And then there's supplements. And right now I don't have my own line, but they're very supportive and I know a lot about them and I teach a lot about them. So I teach all the lab work, the investigation. I teach all the protocols, the habits a person has to follow to overcome their illness or just to get in really fantastic shape. And then we teach a coaching method. So it's three sections. It's 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 really turnkey. It, it's not only you know the investigation and the protocols, but a coaching method, and uh, even selling and how to run your business and um, you know how to go out and do public speaking, all kinds of things. Because I want my graduates to be successful, so I had to include that part. And I really just again duplicating what worked for me in the investigation, in the protocols, and in how I ran my business. Now you're helping these people out, but they're helping their clients out. What what's some feedback you're getting? Are they saying, "Oh, we're take I'm taking my business to the whole next level because all the people I'm actually helping now." Uh, tell me some feedback you get from the trainers, whether it's testimonials or just something you hear all the time. Well, first of all, what I hear a lot because I still personally interview every graduate, you know, three or four or five a week sometimes. And so well, the first thing I hear is that they did it on themselves. So we have a walk the talk program where you run some labs on yourself. I pay for it. It's part of your, your course tuition is you're going to run some labs on yourself. So the first thing I hear is that this has helped me be healthier and happier. So that's good enough for me right there. I mean, that's worth the price of admission, right? But the fact that they now can add that to their list of services or some people just start a whole practice around it. And again, there's a few people that take it just for their own health. So I hear nothing but good things that, you know, this is what they've always wanted to do. They feel very fortunate to uh, receive the training. It's very thorough. It's very, very practical. I've had one testimonial from a PhD said it was better than their PhD program. You know, more practical, more useful information, not yeah. just a bunch of book learning. It's not an academic thing, even though we do go through biochemistry and physiology and anatomy and stuff. You know, you have to know how the body works, uh, but it's really, really practical. So I'd say that would be the number one thing is people who are highly educated, including some chiropractors and acupuncturists and other licensed practitioners, even psychologists and counselors, they're learning to use the investigation, the protocols in their own practices. So I just hear that it's doing some good in the world and that's good enough for me. Sounds like it takes over their whole onboarding process for new clients, just makes that onboarding process much, much easier for them. Uh, once somebody gets their labs back, Obviously, they're going to sign up because they see that they're probably doing a lot of things wrong and need a lot of fixing. Well, yeah, I, I, I find it really fascinating the number of niches there are out there for health practitioners. You can niche uh, uh, to these amazing, uh, you know, small groups. It's, it seems to me they'd be small, but they actually thrive maybe on just, you know, uh, moms who are trying to get pregnant and have some other you know side conditions and or they're you know uh, athletes that want to reach you know competitive level um or they're really sick people chronic fatigue and fibromyalgia and you you name irritable bowel and um autoimmune disease all kinds of things so there it all depends on the practitioner and your niche so you could make it really easy on yourself or you could take really hard cases uh and you're going to have some good results. Yeah. I mean, the success is, you know, it's obvious if you think about it and uh, how you can implement it with your business. So I think that's great what you're offering. So Reed, what's your goal? What's your mission for the next 10 years? So you help people out 10. Now you're doing this. What's, uh, what's your end goal? What's your mission? 
Well, you know, I've been doing it for 10 years, and I guess I'll do it for another 10. And I want to leave a legacy, a piece of work, you know, and a, a body of work, a body of knowledge, and pass it on. Uh, you know, I expect that I one day will, uh, in 10 years, I should sell the business to my employees. And I would just love for them to take it over and run it. Just keep up the good work. You know, um, I'm 64. I'm in great shape. But, you know, you, you just you just don't know. Um, so that's my – I just want to expand and expand, train more people, train more people. Okay. If, if you think about it, <clears throat> my very first mission from the day I was started as a nutritionist slash personal trainer, it was to help as many people as possible yeah. to educate them how to get well and stay well. That mission – was never more clear as it was then, and it's the exact same thing now. It's very clear. So I'm just deputizing as many practitioners as possible. And that's awesome. Thank you for sharing that story. You know, I think it's great what you're doing. I was excited to interview you, hear your story, but I know we're connected with, you know, thousands of fitness, chiropractors, anyone in the health field, and this would be perfect for them. Just expand your uh, niche. Um, bring that onboarding process, make it easier for you, make clients want to sign up with you, and you're a trusted business owner. You're someone that they can trust to work with, and it sounds like a very good mentor also. Yeah, thanks very much for that. I like to think I'm here to help people, and you know, especially the graduates. I created a whole system and uh, sort of post-grad program. We call it the Association of FDN professionals. And I, that's where I kind of separate the, the hobbyist. And that's great. If you want to do this for a hobby, that's good. But the professionals are who I uh, created a whole new program for. It's a tremendous amount of support. So ongoing education and case studies and uh, you know meeting other people who can help you in your business with whatever it might be, the marketing and different things. So, so I have a very robust postgraduate program. It's a awesome. membership thing, and that has grown tremendously. Uh, and so that's part of that legacy, if you will. That's awesome. Thanks for sharing that. I think it's great to have different levels too, because some people just want to do it as a hobby, do it for themselves, or you know, expand and just blow it up for their own business. Uh, where we're exactly. all ready to we're all ready to sign up with you, Reed. Where do we get started? Well, you could go to functionaldiagnosticnutrition.com and you can read about it or just sign up. You know, there's uh, um, it, it's been there. It's just waiting for you. And my staff is waiting for you. We have tremendous customer service and the mentorship program is amazing. People love the fact that you're going to run labs on yourself as you're going through the training and you're going to get personal mentorship. So all my crew who are all over the world, by the way, uh, we're in, I think, I, I have employees in five countries, I think. And, um, you know, so it's regional. We, you know, if you're in Australia, I've got some, if you're in the United Kingdom or, you know, we call it Australasia, obviously the United States and Canada are huge. I think I got an affiliate link, so I'll make sure I post that too. So hopefully uh, whoever's watching, yeah. they reach out to you and uh, stay connected. Yeah, you put that up on the screen for the listeners, and they can go there and visit, and they will get personal service. And if they don't, just talk to me. <laughs> I'll make sure that everything goes great. All right, Reed. Well, thank you so much for your time. Everybody watching, I want to encourage you to live a healthier life. And any business owners out there, check out this program. Try to implement it into your business. The possibilities are endless, and I want to encourage you guys – to reach out to Reed at any time, we'll make sure we post his website above or below. Thank you so much for joining me today, Reed. Hey, thanks so much. Great job, Brad. You're doing fantastic work, and I encourage you and support you 100%. I appreciate it. Thank you. Appreciate it.